Well, finally, Australia is playing host to the world premiere of the latest Star Trek movie. The stars will line the red carpet in Sydney tonight, including one famous Aussie actor who's barely recognisable in the film. Space, the final frontier. Once upon a time, the Starship Enterprise was on a five-year mission. But 42 years after Star Trek was created, movie number 11 is about to be beamed up. Your father was captain of the Starship for 12 minutes. He saved 800 lives. I didn't even know that there had been 10. Like when they said, you know, were you interested in Star Trek? I said, you know, I was never a fan of Star Trek. But the idea of making it something that I actually would care about was very challenging and intriguing. So like Batman and Star Wars, we've gone back to the beginning on the first voyage of the Enterprise with a couple of youngsters called Spock and Kirk. How did you find going around with no eyebrows? That was not easy, I won't lie. They're a big part of my face. There's really no getting around it. The bad guy is an almost unrecognisable Eric Banner thanks to a shaved head and four hours in makeup. I've heard a lot of people um, unaware that it's actually me, which is great. Your own kids, have they seen an image of you yet? Uh, they have, they actually saw it uh, in the flesh uh, when I was shooting, they came to the set and uh, saw Dad all made up and they weren't too scared. I think my agent was freaked out more than my kids were. <laughs> Where's my guy gone? <laughs> a more familiar face belongs to original Spock, 78-year-old Leonard Nimoy, who returns to the franchise after 17 years, making tonight's world premiere a thrill for all Trekkies. Angela Bishop, 10 News.